Last night, the S&P 500 eked out a gain of just plus 0.1%, but nevertheless, that was enough to give it its eighth successive positive session, its longest run since November 2021. Want to know more? Keep watching. Hello, I'm David and this is Trading Today. Yes, we've had an incredible run for US in the stock indices and indeed the European ones as well, who've been caught up in a bit of a bullish bounce back uh, since we had those three back-to-back -back months of selling, which suddenly came to an end at the end of October and has continued into November. Now, our Towards the end of October, on uh, last Friday of October, in fact, we saw the S&P get down to 4,100. As I speak, it's knocking on the door of 4,400. That is a gain of 7% in little under two weeks. An incredible run, and one which would be very frustrating for bullish investors who have, uh, haven't yet get involved because there's been no significant pullback along the way. We've had some times of consolidation, but always push higher to better levels. So it's, it's a very interesting market to be watching at the moment, and it's going to be interesting to see what happens at around this 4400 level as far as the S&P is concerned. Now other things to take note, we had weekly jobless claims out today, they came in as expected just over 200,000 and that is part of a downward trend in jobless claims that we've seen since July this year. We also had some Chinese inflation data out which shows actually deflation around the area, uh, around uh, China, that is for both wholesale inflation and CPI, more proof of a slowing economy um, over there. And other things to note is gold. Gold has fallen be before, be it's fallen below 1950, which was a fairly significant level of support. Now it hasn't broken it um, by very much, and it's still just hovering around that level at the moment, but it's still one to keep an eye on. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you found this of interest. If you did, please like and follow, and best of luck with your trading. Goodbye.